Hi friends, how are you today? Are you ready to sing some songs and read some stories with me? All right, let's go. Let's hop on the good morning train and warm up our engines. The good morning train is coming. How are you? Choo, choo. The good morning train is coming. How are you? Choo, choo. The good morning train is coming. The good morning train is coming. The good morning train is coming. How are you? Choo, choo. Yay. How are you? Are you good? All right. Our nursery rhyme this week is Little Miss Muffet. So we're gonna do it. We're gonna do a couple of little actions. We're gonna sit on our tuffet. We're gonna eat our curds and whey, and then we're gonna be frightened. All right. Little Miss Muffet sat on her tuffet, eating her curds and whey. When along came a spider and sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. Um, if you have a baby, this would be a fun tickle to do, too. So I have my assistant, Tamika, here with me to help demonstrate. So little, we can do this, like, you can do it a little lap. Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider and sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. So you could frighten Miss Muffet away, just bounce, or you could even blunder down, frighten Miss Muffet away. All right, that was kind of fun. All right, our next one. Oh, I need to make it again. We're gonna kick with two legs. We've done this one once before, um, but it's a fun little song or rhyme to do. It's called, Can You Kick With Two Legs? And you're doing very simple actions that you can either manipulate baby's arms and legs for, or that even a, even a toddler or a, a baby could get this one as well. It, this is called, Can You Kick With Two Legs? And it's to the tune of Mary Had A Little Lamb. Can you kick with two legs, two legs, two legs? Can you kick with two legs, kick, 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 kick? Can you wave with two arms, two arms, two arms? Can you wave with two arms, wave, 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 wave? Can you pat your legs, now your legs, now your legs, now? Can you pat your legs, now pat, 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 pat? pat. Can you nod your head, now your head, now your head, now? Can you nod your head, now? Nod, 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 nod. <laughs> you can, and you can do that one with uh, lots of different actions. You can add actions to that one. You could use it as just an everyday activity song. Can you pick up your toys, your toys, your toys? You get the idea. All right. We are gonna do an opposite song. We did an opposite song last week. This is the big, big, big. This is another opposite song. This is called Rolly Poly. And we're gonna roll our hands for this one. Rolly Poly, Rolly Poly. Up, 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 up. Rolly, rolly, poly, rolly, rolly, poly, down, 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 down. Rolly, poly, rolly, poly, yes, 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 yes. Rolly, rolly, poly, rolly, rolly, poly, no, 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 no. Rolly poly, rolly poly, out, 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 out. Rolly roly poly, rolly roly poly, in, 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 in. Rolly poly, rolly poly, fast, 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 fast. Rolly, rolly, poly, rolly, rolly, poly, slow, 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 slow. Good job! All right, let's read a story. 
this one is called My Bed, Enchanting Ways to Fall Asleep Around the World. And so I'm going to read the story of this one. I'm going to read the words, but there's some extra words inside, and also the pictures are just gorgeous. I highly encourage you to come in and check this one out. My Bed, Enchanting Ways to Fall Asleep Around the World by Rebecca Bond, pictures by Sally Maver. My bed rocks on the water. My bed sways in the breeze. They're in hammocks. My bed's beneath a curtain. My bed's aloft in the trees. My bed's a rug of woven wool that my father's mother made. My bed's a mat of river grass that lies beneath the shade. My bed is made from fired clay and heated from below. My bed unrolls on grasslands vast. It travels where I go. My bed is in the courtyard, our family's private space. My bed is on the rooftop, the coolest sleeping place. My bed is built from sturdy wood. My bed is warm. My bed is good. My bed's a futon on the floor. There is no bed I could love more. Can you see me in my bed? I fit so nicely, toe to head. My bed is mine and me, and right. It's bedtime now for me. Good night. So here you can see there's a stitchery note, a note about the illustrations in the back. That's really, really cool. All right, do you wanna find your scarf? Here is my scarf that I have with me from the library, but you can use almost anything for a scarf. An old t-shirt, a towel, washcloth, um, anything you can find really. And so we're gonna take a trip to the moon with our scarves. We're gonna go, we're gonna fly around the moon. So this is called a trip to the moon and the tune is she'll be coming round the mountain. We'll be flying round the moon, yes we will. We'll be flying round the moon, yes we will. We'll be flying round the moon, we'll be flying round the moon, we'll be flying round the moon, yes we will. We'll be landing on the moon, yes we will. We'll be landing on the moon, yes we will. We'll be landing on the moon, we'll be landing on the moon, we'll be landing on the moon, yes we will. Now, for the fun part, I mean, not that dropping our scarves isn't fun, but we're gonna toss them in the air. We'll be blasting off again, yes we will. We'll be blasting off again, yes we will. We'll be blasting off again, we'll be blasting off again, we'll be blasting off again, yes we will. Woo! Yay! All right, so we went out, we went to the moon. Now we're gonna pretend our scarf is a fish. We're gonna move it like a, it's a fish in the water. Oh, no, we're not, we're not. We're gonna toss our scarves, I was wrong. <laughs> we're gonna toss them again. So if you weren't ready, if you weren't, if, you, if that wasn't enough for you at the end of Trip to the Moon, you get to toss some more. Here we go. This is Toss Your Scarves to the Tune of Jingle Bells. Toss your scarves, toss your scarves, toss them way up high. Toss your scarves up in the air until they reach the sky. Wave your scarves, wave your scarves, wave them round and round. Twirl your scarves round one more time, then let them all fall down. 
Let's do that one again one more time. All right, here we go. Toss your scarves, toss your scarves. Toss them way up high. Toss your scarves up in the air until they reach the sky. Wave your scarves, wave your scarves, wave them round and round. Twirl them round one more time, then let them all fall down. Good job. So let's thank our scarves today for helping us. Thank you very much, scarf. And we'll put them away. Zing. All right, we're gonna do a little lap bounce. This is one is a new, new one to me. I should have printed this on one side, one-sided paper instead of two-sided paper, but that's okay. All right, so we're gonna sit it. We're sitting in our high chair. This is a food song, a little food song. So I've got Tamika here who's gonna bounce with me. Here we go. Sitting in my high chair, my chair, high chair, sitting in my high chair, banging my spoon. Sitting in my high chair, my chair, high chair, sitting in my high chair, banging my spoon. Bring in the carrots, bring out, bring on the peas. Won't somebody feed this baby, please? Sitting in my high chair, my chair, high chair, sitting in my high chair, banging my spoon. Bring on the jelly, bring on the bread. Will some, won't somebody see that baby is fed? Sitting in my high chair, my chair, high chair, sitting in my high chair, banging my spoon. Bring on the mustard, bring on the ham. Can anybody see how hungry I am? <laughs> that one is really silly. We'll do that one again in a couple of weeks because it's just, it's really fun. All right, let's read another story. Uh, this one is called Doggy Gets Scared. All right, and we're reading this one with permission from Candlewick Press, Doggy Gets Scared by Leslie Petrichelli. We were reading My Bed, and we were reading this one also with permission from Houghton Mifflin Harcourt. Doggy Gets Scared by Leslie Petrichelli. Doggy is scared of many things, like shadows and swimming pools and strangers and loud noises. Boom! When Doggy gets scared, I try to help. Blanky? Sometimes it works. Sometimes it doesn't. Doggy gets scared when we have to go to daycare. Don't be scared, Doggy. We'll play and snack and nap. And then Daddy comes. Daddy! Doggy gets scared when he can't see Mommy. Mommy? There she is. Mommy, where's Doggy? Uh-oh. It's okay, we'll find him. I'm so scared. Doggy, 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 doggy. There he is. Whew, doggy was so scared. Doggy gets scared at bedtime. Don't be scared, doggy. We have each other. Oh, here's all lots of things that can be scary and then things that can make that scary go away, like laughing and deep breaths, a nightlight, hugs, friends, all of those things help scary go away. All right. Do you want to find your rhythm sticks? So this is a new addition to Baby Bounce. We're gonna use some rhythm sticks. These are just two wooden dowels that have been sanded down. You could use wooden spoons, you could use drumsticks, you could use plastic spoons or metal spoons even. Just something that you can bang and make some noise. 
All right, so we're gonna just start out with peas, porridge, hot. Nursery rhymes, a lot of the time when we do nursery rhymes, they're good because they have a steady rhythm. And steady rhythm is really important, like we've said before, for for helping to just like make a bunch of connections in baby's brain. Having steady beats can help later on with math and reading, especially like with speaking fluency. So. We're gonna give this a go. This is peas, porridge, hot. I'm gonna bang my sticks together. You can bang them on a chair. You can bang them on the floor. Whatever works for you. Here we go. Peas, porridge, hot. Peas, porridge, cold. Peas, porridge in the pot. Nine days old. Some like it hot. Some like it cold. Some like it in the pot. Nine days old. Good job. All right, our next, our next rhythm stick song is Miss T taps with one hammer. So we're gonna start with one stick. You need both of them though, we're gonna start with one. All right, here we go. Miss T taps with one hammer, one hammer, one hammer. Miss T taps with one hammer. Can she tap with two? Do you think she can tap with two? Let's see. All right, here we go. Miss T taps with two hammers, two hammers, two hammers. Miss T taps with two hammers. Can she tap with three? Can she tap with three? Well, we can't hold another hammer, but maybe we can pretend our foot is a hammer and we'll stomp one of our feet. Here we go. Miss T taps with three hammers, three hammers, three hammers. Miss T taps with three hammers. Can she tap with four? Can we do four? Can we do both feet? Let's try. Here we go. Miss T taps with four hammers, four hammers, four hammers. Miss T taps with four hammers. Can she tap with five? Five? Five hammers? Our head. Let's use our head. Are you ready? Here we go. Miss T taps with five hammers. Five hammers. Five hammers. Miss T taps with five hammers. That's all she can tap with. <laughs> all right. Good job. We're training to be drummers. We're coordinating all those different parts. So let's put our rhythm sticks away. Thank you for helping us today. Boom, and we'll put them down. And you can find your shaker. So this is my shaker here. Um, you can have a shaker like this. You can make your own shaker at home. You can just put some rice, dry rice in a Tupperware. You can put dried beans in a tin can. You can put dry popcorn, unpopped popcorn kernels in between two burger plates and staple them together. Anything that you can shake and is gonna make some noise. All right. So we're going to shake and we're going to practice stopping. Okay, here we go. Everyone can shake, shake, shake. Everyone can shake, shake, shake. Everyone can shake, shake, shake. And then we make a stop. Good job. Now let's tap. We'll tap on the back of our hand. Everyone can tap, tap, tap. Everyone can tap, tap, tap. Everyone can tap, 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 and then we make a stop. What else could we do? We tapped, we shake, we've shaken, we could swirl, we could like pretend we're washing. Everyone can wash, wash, wash. Everyone can wash, wash, wash. Everyone can wash, 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 and then we make a stop. What do you think? Is my screen clean now? Can you see me? All right, one more shaker song. Um, this one is called, Can You Shake Along With Me? Can you shake along with me, along with me, along with me? Can you shake along with me? Put your shaker on your knee. Where else should we, could we put our shaker? Ooh, all right, here, let's do that one. Can you shake along with me, along with me, along with me? Can you shake along with me? Put your shaker on your elbow. 
I'm gonna go with elbow. <laughs> All right, so you can keep going at ad infinitum continuously, choosing different body parts. It could go on your nose, it could go on your earlobe, your head, your shoulder, even your tummy. All right, so I'm gonna put my shaker aside. We're gonna sing our goodbye for now song because that's all the time we have for today. So I'm gonna play my ukulele and sing the song. If you wanna shake your shaker or beat your rhythm sticks or wave your scarf, you can do that. Sing along with me if you know the words. This is called The More We Get Together. The more we get together, together, together. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. Cause your friends are my friends and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. I know I'm happier when we get together. I'll see you again soon, friends. Bye-bye for now.